even without this, but that's a fun strategy. I'm just trying to get this working. If it doesn't work, I don't know. Everything about it. Okay, I really want this one. I kinda want tanks. And I want this. It's quite a few things I want. And the radio is quite important. It's probably a bigger bonus than most of this stuff. Mm, what should I get? Yeah, I won't have uh, uh, any IC for building um, that yet. Yeah, so we're saving uh, points for war economy. Should we be able to get it during the war? I don't know. Maybe not. Maybe I won't be. Yeah, that's actually quite possible. I might not have 150. And that really delays me. I guess I could always push and mobilize. It's a waste of point in a way, but it's something. I could go for total mobilization. Yeah, that might actually be better. Total mobilization right away. It loses me some recruitable population, but I get some from my fo uh, special focus tree, so it kind of breaks even. Yeah, this might be better. Yeah, so let's go for total mobilization as soon as possible. See what they do. Yeah, building factories for me. Okay. Uh, okay, France don't join the Allies. The UK tries to do something with Greece. Oh, I can just skip this nonsense and go straight here. And I need to, oh yeah, just need a few factories. That is really nice. Um, yeah, we're going to get that. So let's get research thought as soon as possible. So with the research slot, I'm going to go for... Uh, let's get radio, that's actually quite useful. The bonus is, seems like it's tiny, 5%, but it just increases your reinforced chance from 2% an hour to 7% an hour, which makes quite a lot of difference. Okay, yep, and guarantee spawn can start right away. So, if they get guaranteed right like now, I'm gonna be so pissed. Yeah, we're like one month too late. Well, they're not guaranteeing a, a day yet, because we didn't generate any tension, so... Oh, uh, I think my trade with Gangshi click just ended because there's no more Gangshi click, so let's trade with... Um, Canada? Sure, that sounds safe. So... Right now we have 33 factories, let's see how many we're gonna capture. Motorization, that's completely useless. Construction 3, that's I think too... Good, we have to save that for uh, passion, for uh, total mobilization. Construction 3, yeah, so... I should, I should probably let them finish this, because I just need to start the war. I don't need to finish the war, so I should just let them... Uh, just take my time. They can't join the faction just yet, okay. Uh, it's too early for that. Uh, I'm going to motorize at some point, I'm going to maintenance company at some point, but that's not yet. So, uh, I'm gonna try to get medium tanks relatively early. So, let's get some tanks. Yes, yeah, so we're going to wait for the all of them, not just one. We have to declare all the same day. It just decreases the chance of guarantee spam. Yep. Just wait a few more days. Okay, there's no guarantee spam yet. The last time I tried this, it's... Uh, I actually tried Czechoslovakia first, I think. But Estonia got guaranteed spam because I just didn't declare the same day. And that was the mistake. Yeah, let's get the next one. And the fun begins. And we can finally change it. Oh, and I can't get any of those because none of them have enough factories. That is such bullshit. Ah. Yep, can do it. Just can do it. It's so horrible. That's another reason to go fascist as soon as possible. Because they don't have enough factories. Together they have as, much as many factories as I do, but I need to fight one strong country, not three medium-sized countries. Ah. Is there any chance? Like, how many factories those bastards have? 
This is 13 factories. Let's do the math. I'm just gonna do the math. Uh, yeah, that's one factory too, too short. Okay, maybe if we wait with them, uh, they're going to have exactly number of factories for our economy. Assuming the dockyards are counted and we're not going to make any more factories. Uh, no, we're going to make one more factory. Is it, no, it's not going to change the minimum. So we need 14 factories. We need to fight somebody with 14 factories. Uh, so we're basically waiting now. Okay, this is embarrassing, but we have to wait. We have to wait now <laughs> for this focus to finish. If this focus finishes, maybe we'll be able to switch to... Uh, War economy. That is so embarrassing. Okay. I find this embarrassing. Yeah, we have to wait for that. Uh, I don't think there's any risk unless we wait like crazy long. If you wait crazy long, obviously there's going to, factions are going to start uh, triggering. But right now it's not a, enough of a risk. Oh, they're actually trying to fight me. Yeah, it's fine. Whatever. I don't care. Just wait for this one month. I don't want to take any lands because then I have more factories. I don't want more factories. Oh yes, let's actually make sure we don't make this fast. We don't build this factory just yet. We're just going to wait with it. Yeah, it's fine. They can't do anything to us. I know this is silly, but seriously, we just have to do it this way. Just waiting for them to finish. That's like... Actually, this is the same timer. That's gonna be 20 more days. Okay, 20 more days of sitting there waiting for them to build the factories. I don't know if actually dockyards count, because if dockyards don't count, then that's completely useless. But if they do, that gives them two factory slots, which is exactly what we need. Yeah, our armies are crap. Like, those armies are total garbage. I can actually deploy some units. Okay, let's deploy them all here. Oops. Everybody goes to Warsaw. And I just need one set of you. And yeah, let's just delete that. Come on. I just need one of those two buttons. I don't think I uh, will have 50%, but I will have 40%, which is good enough. That's good enough. Eventually we're going to go to the mobilization probably at some point, but... Let's just wait for them. That's just so close. Well, if dockyards don't count, then I'm just wasting time, but... This is something I'm gonna learn today. What does it actually mean? Yeah, all well those attacks are completely useless, it means nothing. 120, yeah, that's fine. Oh yeah, let's build more of that. Come on, come on. Good. So, can we actually change the world economy now? Yes! Yes, yes! This is such a nice hack! I waited. Okay, so dockyards count to this percentage. Uh, right, so we have work economy. This doubles our uh, uh, C factor. Okay, now we can actually fix it. So, uh, this is actually helpful that much. I thought it was gonna help more. Why didn't it help more? I, I don't know. Anyway, let's get the next. Uh, yes, we're going to go for next research slot. And then we're going to get all the factory focuses. Okay, now we can actually win this war. Um, there's no more reason to wait. Uh, yeah, destroy that, destroy that. Uh, they have so few armies, I'm just gonna outmaneuver them and we're gonna try to do anything cute. Like, every one of those war is separate.
Right, you're going there. Oh, I thought they're gonna leave. It's fine. separate wars so uh, it's very easy to encircle them now If, the, if, the, if they have enough troops to have like a proper front line, it's completely different world than when they don't. If they don't, you just do this kind of nonsense. Like, this is nonsense what we're doing. It's just silly nonsense. What happened to the factories? Did they get damaged? No idea. No idea what happened. Okay, let's just pin this guy. Yeah, we're not building any planes, it's completely pointless. Okay, I uh, think we should start closing it in. No idea how many divisions they have, the number is probably not that higher than much higher than zero. Okay, are they like capitulated yet? Yeah, Latvia is done. Yeah, let's get those bastards uh, up. Obviously we're taking everything. Yeah, 45 factories already. Yeah, that's gonna get fast really quickly. And that's exactly... Wait, why take the oil? That's fine. Get them from Mexico. Uh, yeah, just go for it. So all you guys... Okay, I don't even know who's where, so I'm just gonna get half of them. Is it half? No, it's a bit too many. Let's get those guys here. Uh, Alright. So we just need to basically get Kaunas and we don't care about anything else, so let's do just that. Oh, apparently they have someone. It's gonna take one day, one hour. It's gonna take two hours, okay. Let's just try to sneak in. Would be kinda nice to have cavalry maybe instead, but yeah. It's fine. Exactly what I, mean, what I need. Um, yeah, actually, let's get Tartu, why not? Am I going to be on time? One day. Uh, one day, yeah, that's fine. Um, we have almost the right number of factories. 
uh, to get our reset slot. Exactly, take all states and turn up. And the last thing is just to get Estonia. Oh, we have more troops, that's amazing. And two of them actually have artillery, so... Uh, let's take a quick look. Uh, our artillery production, our production, uh, yeah, that's... Let's increase artillery especially. It's going quite well. Okay, let's just rebase you, let's say... Here? That's fine. Not sure, not sure if German is gonna get, get Memel as well, they might, but that's just one factory and there's not a core state, so it's not really a big difference to us. I'm playing on speed 4, oh my god, I just completely missed that. I just don't play worse at speed 4 normally, it's just such a strange thing to do. Okay, uh, oh, that's fine. Get those guys, let's get them here. Yeah, more steel, that's fine. Uh, those guys have a bit of steel, but not much. And no, we actually did not cause the most tension. The most tension was caused by Japan. Okay, let's wait for him to just finish. Yep, Tallinn's gone. It's all done. Right, I don't care about any of this stuff. What I care about is motorized and maintenance companies. So, yeah, let's get this. It's fine. There might be some bonus for motorized, but I don't remember. And that's the war. That is all the war. Wait, is that not the war yet? Oh, they actually, uh, yeah, they need to get some random small provinces. Fine. Okay. If we need to, we can get them, that's fine. But that's the fair Polish strategy. We built Mienzimorze by conquering everything here. And we're done. So that was step one. Step two is to attack Soviet Union. Sounds easy? Because it is easy. Uh, they have something like 200 of those. Uh, so they have like 120 factories versus our 52. Shouldn't be too hard. Okay, let's get everybody. It's very winnable. It's extremely winnable. Uh, we can, yeah, we can start with a big front line. I'm gonna divide it later. Uh, where are we recruiting them? Uh, let's deploy them here instead. Just slightly closer. Doesn't really make a huge difference. Yeah, straight from Moscow. This is the plan. So the fun plan of Soviet Union is just we're going to fabricate on Mongolia or Tanutuva. So they have less of a warning. You could even have an aggression pact with those bastards. Yeah, they will not accept. Yeah, well. Yep, we could just do just that. Uh, I think I'm going to wait a bit until we have... Can we get even 100 divisions? Like, realistically. Yeah, it seems that we can. 100 divisions is not unusual. So, well, after we have 100 divisions or so, uh, we should declare one Soviet Union. Yeah, I'm not worried about Germans and Chinese and stuff. Yeah, everybody should go to the same order. Everybody go here, I'll reorganize them later. Uh, hopefully didn't miss anyone. Nope, that's my 49 divisions. So let's take a look at what we need and what we have. We, we're going to wait 200 days for that, 400 days for that, and we're not producing any support. What? Really? 
I think that's a glitch. When you're occupying stuff, this might this might have glitched. I think this was a glitch. Oh, is that when I'm deploying stuff? Okay, let's just do this. Um, I can't be bothered with support, so I'm just going to remove that from our good divisions. Yeah, that's pointless. I don't want that. Waste of time. Just waste of time. Uh, recon is crap. Uh, I, I mean, it's not crap, it's just luxury we can't afford. So, we're eventually going to need that for maintenance companies, but for now let's just ignore this completely. Yeah, so this is going to slowly, slowly happen. This is 260 days. But that's fine. 130 yet. Yeah. So, how many divisions do we have in training? That's okay, that's all going to be just fine. Right, what do we do next? Uh, that's ahead of time. That'll be okay, that'll be okay. Let's just look at the bonuses first. No, this is ahead of time. Uh, do I have maintenance? I don't have maintenance yet. We'll need that at some point. Uh, yeah, do you really producing tanks? That's fine. Yeah, let's do the maintenance. One, yeah, I'm going to for like 100 divisions. The number is just going to increase very quickly. Yep, we have an extra research slot. Well, we're going to have one soon. So we got a total of 20 factories here. And that's six. This is uh, eight. And that's. Oh, come on. And that's five? How does it add up to... I don't even know. Did it get destroyed or something? I don't think so. Did that even happen? Oh, sorry, there's also my That's one factor missing. I think that should add up to the right number. Or something close to it. Okay, military factories. Let's build more military factories because that's the only thing that matters. Um... I guess dockyards are also okay, but not right now. And yeah, sieve factory is completely useless. Right, so what can we do? Uh, what do we have? Army offense, 10% division attack. That sounds lovely. Uh, that's okay. I don't care about any of that stuff. Do I want that? Uh, at some point we will want a uh, tank designer, but not just yet. Infantry expert. Okay, let's start with division attack. Oh no, let, okay, let's start with Furious and then we're going to get division attack. Fall of Nanjing, yeah. Such a fun casual game. Oh, China Declare won Tibet because they're not losing enough. Oh, by the way, because we're playing with the mod and this increases the Chinese strength slightly, they might just be able to survive. Probably not, but they might just have a tiny chance of winning, uh, pushing Japan out. Uh, probably won't happen, but it's possible. In Vanilla 1.1, never happens. China always loses very quickly. Here, there's a small chance that they're gonna uh, do well. Okay, so what would you like to do? And uh, they don't seem to have that much, and right now they have probably like a massive officer purged penalty, 35%. So by the time we attack it's gonna be like minus 25%, not the highest, it's quite okay. Uh, we could probably... Uh, yeah, it's... we need more divisions just to like cover the entire border. 200 days, 214 days. We still have a lot of crappy divisions, like those guys with no artillery. Ah, maybe we should cancel them, yeah, let's cancel them. Okay, let's just start building the proper ones. So, how much artillery do we need? 300 days worth of artillery, so. That sounds fine. 
So a fabrication on uh, Mongolia, how long will that take? Uh, 135 days. So, uh, if we want to attack by the end of the year, and we should fabricate, I don't know, like May or something. Okay, let's get, let's wait until May. And yeah, I'm giving Germans dancing. I don't care. And Memel if they want. It's not worth that that much. Yeah. This is fuck's sake. This is like the AI. I just told them to put a front here, right? What the fuck is this? Those two places, entire half my army is here. I just hate this bullshit. Oh my god, that's such bullshit. You just have to do it manually. Even doing a simple fucking front. How? Like this is the simple. I, I'm not talking about any fancy maneuvering. Just put a fucking front line here. Nope, too hard. It's just too hard. I have to do it manually. All of it. Fuck's sake. Okay, let's do it manually then. Oh my god, I hate this shit. F stop this nonsense. Ah! Okay, I'm just quite annoyed right now. I just fucking ca I can't stand this game sometimes. Bastards are joining this one in the middle. Oh my god, I just such bullshit. Seriously, how difficult is it just to put them like in some relatively even way? Can you cross here? Like, is this part of the border or not? There's a lake here. Okay, this is the lake. Okay, so this is not part of the border. Okay, that's fine then. Oh, so I don't need that many guys. Okay, it's fine. Just, let's just adjust those borders a bit. Alright, I see that you are a bitch. I have to manually set up the entire fucking front line. What kind of bullshit is this? It's like, seriously, that's such an easy thing. It's like, and I think in, in 1.0 it even worked. It just stopped working in 1.1. It used to work, it, wa it wasn't that retarded, it's just really retarded right now. But it used to be okay. It's like the simplest possible order. And it's completely fucking up. Yeah, why do you have six of those fuckers here? What is the point? There's no point, it's completely nonsense. There's never any reason to have like more than four in one. Ah, such bullshit. That's why they have to bribe you with uh, planning bonuses. Because this is a bribery. Basically, planning boss is a bribe. Um, is it part of the front line? Okay, that's also part of the front line. Ah, so annoying. At least when the short and front line is like less mess to fix. What the fuck are you. But why don't you. Why are you wasting your equipment? Why don't they strategically deploy? It's a peacetime. Fuck's sake. It's fucking peacetime. 
It's such bullshit! The... It's so dumb! We we'll probably have to fix it later. Okay, this one looks okay. No, it's not. What are you doing? What the fuck are you doing? Go here. Fortunately, at least, they, once you move them around, they usually stop uh, doing silly things and just like obey your orders. Okay, so let's call it this army Leningrad. Okay, so this is army Leningrad. And it seems to be fine. Okay, now it's fine. Assuming this is a lake, that seems like a proper lake. So Tartu is on the other side of the lake. Okay, this one just doesn't have enough forces, but it's gonna get them later. So it can't possibly be okay. What the hell? Yep, decided to start losing equipment, because why the fuck not? It's like, why the five? Why? You don't have... Uh. Okay, two, two... Like, what the fuck? What the fuck makes this... Like, it's so horrible. This is so horrible. Just strategically redeploy yourself, fuckers. Stand here is fine. Good. Okay. Three, four, three, four, three, four. That's fine, I guess. Okay, let's delete all this nonsense. I don't want any more uh, infantry with nothing. Three hundred days, two hundred twenty days. Yes, yeah, relatively similar. So eventually, the build is going to be six mountaineers, um, two artillery, and one medium tank. Is this border tile or not? I have no idea. Let's move, move it here. Yeah, and they're not. They're just wasting equipment by not actually using. And strategic redeployment. Just to annoy me. I can't feel any other explanation. So obnoxious. Okay, just move to Riga. Okay, we have the first level of tank. We're not building them. We're going to start building those ones. Uh, but first we have to reach that level. It sounds like sort of like in my mind I just like oh I'm gonna play a game and I'm gonna just just like you know have all the fights and stuff that sounds fun and then it turns out I'm actually trying to play the game and there's just so much bullshit with the interface okay okay that's a doctrine bonus that's fine I don't think I care about any of this nonsense no this is military factory production this is 20% produ construction speed bonus that's actually quite nice and that's industry bonus yeah I think we're just going to go for this. 20% uh, uh, military factory construction speed sounds lovely. And we can reset something. Oh, that's 38 already. Okay, let's go for it. Okay, I never care about that, so just cancel this. Okay, does it look okay? Vaguely. Yeah, let's take a look at the templates, just for some comparison. Uh, so we have this template, which has attack 66. Uh, so attack 66, production 500. And this template, which has attack 152, drastically more, production 686. So, like, relative to production cost, that's not even close. Okay, I'm just going to get all of you bastards. Uh, yeah, I think I don't need infantry. Like, infantry is a waste of time. Let's get you all to be proper divisions. Yeah, I don't have turret artillery, but I'm gonna make that. And it's quite optimistic, so... And if I ever get maintenance company, I'll go and start training them, because right now they're all noobs. So that's gonna take a while. 500 days, that's way too long, actually. Okay, let's get a bit more of that. 